Hey everyone, um, I'm sorry I look so rough. <laughs> um, basically, I just washed my hair and I don't have any makeup on because I am cleaning today. But, as I was cleaning, I was putting um, away a bunch of laundry. It's New Year's Day so I figured I might as well clean. And organize myself to start out the year but um, I realized that on Sunday I went shopping and I got a bunch of stuff at the um, after Christmas sales so I figured I would make a little video about that um, before I clean everything because I'm gonna be cleaning up all my clothes here too so yeah I just thought I would stop and show it what it is that I got that way um, I think all this stuff is still on sale and I can link it in case anyone is curious and the main thing that I got actually everything I got was um, business casual clothes for my upcoming internship that starts on January 14th. Basically, I wanted some more like trendy, stylish business casual clothes because even though I wear business casual at my job, it's like pretty casual because I just sit in a room and answer phones. So I wanted to make like a good impression at my internship. So I wanted to kind of restock shirts, pants, even shoes. So that's what I did. Um, yeah, definitely spent a lot of money, but I got a lot of stuff for what I spent. So I figured I might as well show you what I got in case you um, need ideas of business casual clothes too. Um, yeah, it's just good to know where to find cute stuff because some of it is really not. And yeah. I found some really good deals, so hopefully this helps some of you out. So, a really nice place that I found um, shirts was Express. They had pretty good sales going on, not so much for their pants. Those were like, buy one, get one 50% off, and their pants are like $80 usually, so it would still be pretty expensive, but I did find a lot of really nice shirts. And all their sweaters were $24.95, and they were originally like $54, $44, so the first thing I got was this. If you can see that, it's kind of like a light blush color. It's really, really warm and thick and nice, and it goes longer in the back, so I can also wear it with leggings, which is nice. Or you can tuck it in. It's just like really versatile. So that's what it looks like. I got another sweater. This one was regularly $39.95. I also got it for $24.95. So basically a little over $10 off. That's what that looks like. So these are three quarter length sleeves. They look kind of short, but when you're when they're on person, they look more normal. <laughs> um, but I'm also five two, so things are longer on me. <laughs> um, this sweater also goes longer in the back, so um, it looks good with dress pants or with leggings, which is really nice because I like to wear leggings with boots and long sweaters too. That's what I mostly wear at my job, so that's nice. Again, that's what that looks like. The next two things I got are both the same but different colors. I got um, some button-up shirts that they had there that were really cute. I've seen a lot of people wear these with like jeans and heels or jeans and flats, sandals. Um, so you can dress them up or dress them down. But these would look really cute with dress pants too. So the first one I got is another like blush color. So, it just comes down in the back again, but you can tuck it in. Um, this was normally $44.95, and they were all 30% off. 
It's not like a giant deal, but it was still pretty good. And I think I'm going to be wearing these all the time. So I got the same shirt in this blue and white stripe. This was picked out by my boyfriend, so... Um, this was also his idea. But it's another really cute button-up. This one, I think, would look especially cute with jeans. Um, yeah, I love how versatile these shirts are. Because it can look super businessy or just like a really cute dressy casual look so the next thing that i got was from ann taylor i got mostly pants there but a couple shirts the first pair of pants i got were these i've worn these yesterday so they're kind of wrinkly but they're just <laughs> like a gray uh, skinny they're not jeans they're kind of like a soft suede material so they're kind of like skinny chinos maybe I'm not really sure what you would classify them as but they're really cute really soft I got them at um, oh these were all on outlet that's the other thing they were all at the outlet mall that we have um, so this was the Ann Taylor factory I got these in a size 2 all my shirts were in a small or an extra small. Um, so yeah, I got these. I got this shirt. And this shirt is really cute because in the back it has the little bow. The sleeves are kind of fun on it too. It's more of like a dressy shirt. White goes with everything. Um, this shirt was, an origi was originally $54.99. I got it for $10.88. Um, it's an extra small. Yeah, and they do do final sale when they do their clearance at Ann Taylor Outlet. Um, but yeah, if it's so, I won't be returning it. But yeah, it's kind of like a, I don't know if you can see that, like a crepe materi material. But it's really cute. I got another white shirt. <laughs> Um, that's what this looks like. It has fluttery sleeves and a V neck. It's also kind of like a textured material. Um, the sleeves are pretty poofy, but it looks kind of cute tucked in with the pants that I got from there. So I think it's pretty cute. Again, I also got this in an extra small and I got it for $11.88 and it was normally $59.99 so that's a pretty good deal too so yeah you can never go wrong with white it matches every color of pants so the next three things are all dress pants I really like skinny ankle length pants I just feel like those are more what's in style and they're more flattering on me because I'm so short um, it's just what looks best on me and I think what looks the most stylish at the moment um so these were not in their clearance section they did have a lot of pants in their clearance section but i need to get a petite size because i am 5'2 and um there just weren't a ton of petite pants in their clearance uh, when i went so because it was the factory um i just went to the normal area for petite and all their pants were 60 percent off in the petite section Whereas the other, the rest of the store, like normal sizes, was 50% off. So I guess sometimes it does pay to be short. <laughs> um, but yeah, so these pants are normally, let's see, how much are they? They're normally $89.99, but they're 60% off. So I got them for, I think, $32 each. So I think that's still a steal. The gray pants I got from here, I forgot to mention, but those were $31 from the clearance section. So still a pretty good deal and I got three pairs um I took I knew that I was going to be like going all in on the shopping because I needed the stuff because I didn't have that many pants especially nice dress pants so I just had to like invest and get them um so I had them and I wasn't looking like a train wreck at my internship so I got just basic colors and I'll show you those these ones are just black. So, 
that's what they look like. So these are the signature ankle length pants in two. So that's what it is. <laughs> I got it too petite. They fit really nice. Um, and yeah, I highly recommend their pants. They're amazing, especially if you're short. So yeah. Um, so I got black and I'm probably going to do, um, uh, like a try on or like outfit ideas video with business casual clothes just because I feel like it's hard to think of cute outfits. So if there's any inspiration people can give, it's nice to have, but yeah, these are just the black and they also had like a gray in this denim -y kind of color and texture. They didn't have the gray in my size, but I do already have a gray pair of pants like these that I forgot about. Um, so I got this like denim -y color. I don't know if you can kind of see, but it's like they're a little bit thicker too, which was nice. So a little bit of texture in with my clothes. I keep forgetting about the sweater. The like, day before I went shopping at a mall and I couldn't find anything except one thing, which was a sweater from Dry Goods. And I think Dry Goods is only around in the Midwest, but I could be wrong. But I got this sweater out of their clearance as well. <laughs> so it's just a nice basic neutral sweater that matches literally everything I got. So this will be super nice too. I got it in an extra small and it was normally $39 and they got it for $19. So that's pretty good. So then I went to Target because I've noticed lately that Target's had a lot of cute shoes and they're pretty inexpensive. Um, so the first pair of shoes I got are these like blush nude suede uh, loafers, I guess you would call them. So I don't know if you can tell, they're kind of like more on the pink side in person. Um, but yeah, I just thought these were super cute. All I have is a pair of black flats, um, which, you know, match most things, but doesn't always look the best with everything. So I figured with, um, the blush sweaters and shirt that I got and, um, like any outfit that would be better with tan, I can wear these. They just were too cute. I couldn't leave them behind. <laughs> these in a seven and a half and they were... $27.99. The next pair of shoes I got are these black slide on loafers. Obviously, like I've seen these everywhere, and I'm sure you have too. Like people have been wearing them probably all year. Um, they were like a huge statement because of the Gucci ones, but obviously I'm not on a Gucci budget, so um, I got these. When they first came out, I wasn't crazy about them, but the more I saw people style them, I just was like, those are really cute. And I think they're like trendy, but still classy looking. So I got these, also a New Day brand from Target, and they were $22.99, and I got a 7 and a half. I also went to Ulta just because I got a gift card um, from my aunt, and I got the... Morphe X Jaclyn Hill brush set. So it's the Eye Master collection. Um, it comes with this glittery bag, and then there are eight brushes. It's like a really nice set, I thought. I never have enough eye pencil or eye pencils eye brushes and I figured I'll probably be putting more work into my makeup for this internship or at least I hope I will <laughs> and anyway I love eyeshadow that's my favorite part of makeup so I was like you know what I'm gonna invest in like a nicer collection of brushes so that's what I did they all are really soft and I can't wait to try these out the last thing I got was I got on Friday with another Ulta gift card. I got, I had that one from Christmas and then I bought this on Friday and then I got another Ulta gift card that Saturday and another Christmas. But um, basically I just decided to upgrade my straightener 
and I got the Babyless Pro Nano Titanium straightener. So this is what it looks like. It's digital and you control it here and it memorizes what heat setting you used. It's got titanium plates. Um, so far I really like it. Like when you're straightening your hair you don't even feel your hair going through it really. Um, which is nice because my old straightener was kind of cheap and it would like pull out my hair. But at this, my hair just glides right through it. I've heard a lot of really good things about this brand. This one was $99, so if you are needing or wanting to look at these, this is the one I got. The $99 one at Ulta. Um, yeah, they have kind of a wide price range for these. There was one underneath this that was like... 64 and then they go up as high as like $179. I wasn't going to be that bougie, but I wanted to make sure that I got something relatively nice if I was going to upgrade my straightener and I had a gift card, so that helped. Um, but yeah, so far I've really liked having like a nicer straightener and I hope it lasts a long time, but I just keep hearing about the Babyless Pro or Babyless Pro, however you say it. Um, their straighteners like how much people love them and even um like the i was asking the store manager at ulta about them and she said that um she loves them too and they never really get returns of these but they do of the chi ones which i had heard the quality of chi had gone downhill so i didn't want one of those but so far I've really really been liking this i'm gonna be using it later obviously but yeah i'm a big fan and i would definitely recommend trying this out if you're wanting to get a nicer straightener and you have some gift cards to ulta um yeah i don't think you can go wrong with having nice hair tools especially when you don't want to damage your hair and you're trying to keep your hair as healthy as possible while heat styling it um i think it is a good thing to invest in some nicer tools to do so so yeah, that was just kind of a quick little haul of stuff I got on After Christmas Hills. I will link whatever I can find down below or similar products. But yeah, um, I know it was kind of like a short ratchet video, but I just wanted to show, be, show you things before it became irrelevant <laughs> and so I could keep cleaning, honestly. But yeah, um... Stay tuned, I guess, for more videos, and I think I will be doing, like, a business casual looks eventually. I'll probably get a couple more things, like, as time goes by, especially when we start going into spring, but I feel like I got a pretty good start, so, yeah, thanks for watching. Bye.